Music, dancing, sunshine and showers. Flakyol Naharan has it all and it's returned to Mullingar for a second year with organisers promising it will be bigger and better than before. From five to six year olds you'll see them playing banjos, accordions, concertinas, harps. Uh, look, it'll be all here uh, and uh, everyone should enjoy the event. Oh, everybody is completely buzzed up here today Sinead. As you can see the weather's brought everybody out now. The atmosphere is just electric so it means really a lot for the town. The flower was officially opened by the Taoiseach Leo Varadkar this afternoon, kicking off a week-long celebration of Irish music and song. I love it. Yeah. And um, like and I'll be happy I smile. We're going to have a great time. And um, a couple of ham sandwiches and tea and we'll be, everything will be fine. Over half a million people will visit Mullingar over the next seven days. And while it's a big boost for business in the town, it's also massive for tourism in the Midlands. It's never, it's never as good a time to introduce people to what this place has to offer. Not only West uh, Mullingar, but the surrounds of the county as well, the lakes, the peatlands, all the visitor attractions we have. It's a tremendous opportunity, and we'll be working hard in Falch Ireland to ensure that that message lasts. Competitions begin on Thursday, but already the world's biggest Irish festival is in full swing. Sinead Hussey, 14 News, Mullingar.